The Neighborhood News Service was started because we felt that there was a need in Milwaukee for people to know more about the activities and issues and concerns of people in the central city. And so we hope to fill that gap by doing objective professional reporting. The Public Policy Forum provides two graduate students every semester to work with the Neighborhood News Service. And the purpose is for them to get experience covering real policy issues in the city. And the addition of the Public Policy Forum students has made a huge difference for our ability to cover the city. Well, the reason I wanted to work with the Neighborhood News Service is because they were going to be covering Clark Square, which is a neighborhood that I live in and grew up in. So finding out that they were, there was actually going to be a news service focusing particularly on a neighborhood that, that I have so much invested in was an uh, immediate draw for me. I mean, I had been looking for a journalism job, and this seemed like this job was made for me. I think that working with the Neighborhood News Service has made me a better writer as far as grammatically. It, it's made me more thorough of a reporter. I know which questions to ask. I know how many different people I need to talk to. I think it's helped me meet people in the community. I know people at organizations. I, I mean, I've always known people in the community, but now I know people across the whole city. When I looked at the NNS, when I was first looking at Marquette as a graduate program, I saw the quality of reporting that was there. And I saw the voices that they were highlighting, which were something that you simply didn't see you know, often in larger news organizations. By focusing specifically on these communities, they were really able to bring these voices to the fore. And I knew that that was something that I wanted to be a part of. You know, Sharon is an editor who really brings out your best work, and you know she's not going to allow you to turn in copy which isn't up to par. And I really think that I've grown as a reporter, not only through her editing, but also through interacting with others on staff and learning from their experiences. Uh, public policy is is huge and complicated, and uh, I really think that Milwaukee is a great laboratory to study public policy, uh, whether it's on the local level. Um, whether it's at the county level or the state level, um, it's just a, a fascinating thing to, to look at, to analyze. And um, unfortunately, policy is this sort of abstract thing, and it's, and it's hard to make it sexy, or it's tough to make it tangible to some of our community's most vulnerable people. And I think um, telling a, a compelling narrative um, analyzing the data and, and having that be sort of a supplement to the narrative, um, those two complement each other and, and really um, educate our community. Yeah, I, I think without the fellowship, I don't know if I would be here. Uh, I think it provides me with um, the, the, the financial support, with the personal support, and the uh, professional support that I was looking for. The collaboration between a university like Marquette with all these other entities gives us a chance to preserve the kind of quality journalism we want to see in our communities when a business model for that has functionally disappeared. So this kind of partnership is critical. Our students learn from the experience, we contribute back to our community, and I really do believe that we're creating something new. It's a model that could be replicated in other cities. So we're pioneers, we're forging new ground. On a couple of occasions, I've had students who had the experience of working at the Neighborhood News Service come back to me a year or so later. And what they say is, that was the most important and critical experience I had in my preparation for my career as a journalist. I don't know how you top that.